What's up guys, it's the Bees here today. Um I'm gonna be teaching you how to jailbreak your iPod touch on um firmware version um five point oh point one. Um the only jailbreak that's available for this i i device is tethered jailbreaks because there's no untethered yet. But um what you're gonna have to do um is download it go to this page that it will be in the description. Um, download the IPSW for iOS 5, but do not download Red Snow because that is the wrong one. Um, there will be another page that looks like this. Um, just download the attachment, which is the correct Red Snow, and another link that I'll be putting um, the tutorial for Mac computers. This is the tutorial for Windows computers. Um, once you download Red Snow and the IPSW, put it somewhere where you remember it. I put it on my desktop. Um, you open up Red Snow. And you're going to want to go to Extras. Um, select IPSW. Um, select your IPSW that you downloaded. Um, you're going to want to go back and then Jailbreak. Just wait until it loads up. Okay, once you do this, it's going to ask you if you want to install Cydia or and all these other options. Just leave it alone and install what's already checked, um, which is the Cydia and the battery percentage. Um, what you want to you want to do is just click Next and set your device in I, um, DFU mode. Now what you want to do for this is hold the top button for 3 seconds, then hold the top and bottom button for 10 seconds, then let go of this button but keep on holding this until the device is um, being exploited with Limerine or whatever jailbreak. Um, now I'm not going to do this because my, my device is already jailbroken. As you can see, Cydia is on there, is jailbroken, tethered. Um, so what I'm going to do is right after you jailbreak your iDevice, reopen this program. Um, put in your IPSW one more time and then just click on Just Boot to have Cydia up and running. Um, make sure your iDevice is both off and plugged in. So I'm going to do that right now. Okay, once your device is off, you're going to want to set it into DFU mode, as I instructed before. Um, okay, so click Next. Hold the top button 3 seconds. Hold the bottom button and top for 10 seconds. Wait until it shuts off. Okay, so once you do that, you're going to want to release the top button. Keep on holding the bottom button until it's being exploited or restarted. Okay, once you do that, um, this should pop up. Um, it's exploiting with lime rain, whatever. You just gotta wait a couple minutes for it to restart completely. Okay. So uploading second stage, you just gotta wait another two, three minutes. Okay, now it's rebooting, but when it reboots, you should see this pineapple sign, sign instead of um, the Apple logo just to show that the jailbreak has worked. Now, um, every time that you shut off your iPod, um, it will not restart since this is a 
it, it will not boot up regularly since this is a tethered jailbreak. So what you want to do is just reopen Red Snow, um, select your IPSW, and just do the same thing as you would to boot it as it as I am right now. So you're just gonna wait until this done. Okay. So now that it's done, you don't want to wait. Okay, Cydia will still be blank as it is shown on mine, but um, but what you want to do is just let everything install once you open up Cydia. Just gonna want to wait for that. Alright, so, um, this is how you just set up Cydia, whatever, it's gonna take a while, though. Okay, but um, that's just mainly it. Um, run Cydia, wait until everything installs, and then after that, your iPod will be fully jailbroken. Um, don't forget to subscribe, and later.